G'day frothers. So in this video I'm going to go over how you do slow-mo for your surf videos. Works in any sort of sporting video or anything else really, but this is specifically for surfing videos, bodyboarding videos, waves, which is what I do. Now I'm using Premiere Pro, but this will work for most of your editing software packages out there. So this is a fast method. In my next video I'll do speed ramping, which is a slower, more professional way of doing it. But this will work for pretty much any of your videos that you might want to post on YouTube or post on Instagram or Facebook. Um, the footage you might have while you're either out surfing or if you're on the beach. So the first thing you want to do is drag the clip across into your timeline sequence, creates a sequence. As you can see, this is at 120 frames per second or 109.88 frames per second. Uh, you can only really do this if you have shot your clip at a higher frame rate. My videos are cut at 30 frames per second, so it'll allow me to slow this clip down by four times. So what we want to do is go through the clip to where he's about to do his maneuver. Here he does a nice cutback, so we'll do there. We find a spot just prior to where he starts the maneuver. We come across here to the cutting tool or C, the razor tool. Come across to that point on the keyframe. Cut the clip there. Go through to when he's finished the maneuver. Cut the clip. Move this part of the clip away because otherwise it will stretch over the top of it and wipe some of it out. What you then have is this part of the clip which is what you want slowed down. So you simply hover over there, right click, come up to speed duration. Throw in 25% that will go from 120 down to 30. Hit OK. And it has now stretched that part of the clip out into a slow-mo portion. Delete the ripple. There you have it, you now have the maneuver slowed down. We'll just mute this because the sound on this is not what we're after. But the sound is also slowed down. So coming up through the maneuver, he's about to hit this maneuver. Boom. Nice and slow. Comes out of the maneuver. And the clip speeds back up. And that's about it. As I said, that does slow the sound down as well, but in this case, I was shooting from outside a cafe and there's a lot of ambient noise around which didn't go with the surfing, so I'm not gonna bother um, showing that. But in, in my next video, I'll be looking at doing the longer method, which is speed ramping. This method is better for doing professional videos in that it smooths out the cut. As you can see here, as he comes out of the maneuver, all of a sudden he goes fast again. So there's, a, there's no smoothness to that transition from slow to real speed. Anyway, that's it for this video. Any questions, leave them in the comments below. And I'll see you in the next one where I go through speed ramping.